Hello, Americans. Another friend scrounged around along. Back here, man. So as you can see, whoa. As you can see, still, still burning, still trying to clean this crab up. Got a long ways to go. Had rain the last few days, so that uh, it makes it hard to burn. But we're burning and we're chipping and just everything, man. Trying to get rid of this. It's still got a long ways. Still got a long ways to go. Hey man, Houndstown. I'll tell you what, the uh, mosquitoes are uh, definitely out. Insanely. Insanely must be the hatch man going on. It is, uh, I got mosquitoes around it, I guarantee. That fire's getting out of control. That fire's getting out of control, man. Yeah, it's something that I, in yesterday's video, I showed a few uh, things I picked up. One thing that I missed, and this looks all fancy. This man, they've got a country charm written on it. I made sure that the cab came off, that the levers, all done. Tw it twists, but it's painted. You know, because somebody painted this up. And this is an old Dietz lamp, man, with the red shade. Uh, say Dietz, Sarek, Use New York, USA, Fitzall, Log Knob, registered, US patent. And this thing is the real McCoy. But somebody's painted it up. And my plan with it, I might go ahead and list it. You know, uh, what they shabby chic or whatever the hell they call this. A new crap. I don't like it. I think, man, I would have much rather had this thing all rusty and. Yeah. My style. But uh, I went ahead and bought it. I think I gave about five bucks for it. And this lantern, <coughs> dude, the cotton and everything's getting to me bad. But uh, this old lantern with the red globe and all that. If this was rusty, you know, like my old one, wherever the heck it is, which is another Dietz. If it if it was like that with the red globe, probably seventy five to hundred bucks. This condition, all painted up fancy. I have no idea. We're going to find out. Ooh. Holy moly. Hey, hey. So, what is that crazy hillbilly up to now? Oh, look at all the cotton on that. Um, right now, what I'm doing is, uh, digging. I'm going to clear this path out here so that I can get through here. And going through this stuff, I don't even know if you can hear me. Going through this stuff, the stuff that's going to get uh, yard sale or flea marketed, and the stuff that's going to get eBayed, and the stuff I'm going to keep. And getting all the tools back into one area. So that's what I'm in the process of doing right now. Man, I've got this stuff, man, this uh, Husqvarna Weed Eater, man. Fifteen bucks, man. I got that thing last year at the end of the season. Don't know if it works. Should. Fifteen dollars for Husqvarna thing about that is, and I've talked about this before, is if this doesn't work, which I don't know why it, uh, 
Why it wouldn't? But if it doesn't, for some reason, you know, they ran gas or whatever through it, you can part that out and sell it. You know, the, the parts and pieces off of an old Husqvarna, old steel, you know, that kind of stuff is, uh, see, a lot of times you can make more money parting something out than you can, uh, But a lot of times, parting something out, you make more money on it than selling the whole dang thing. I don't even know where this dang wire came from. Holy crap. Must have lost the whole box. I've got a... Anyway, man, that's a. That's whole thing. That was in the um, dumpster at the. Uh, I think it was the Forest Service dumpster. This I ain't taped. Then I ended up. Uh, trading for that, but uh, it came out of a dang dumpster. Okay, man, I'm sure you don't want to watch me uh, dig through this stuff. Oh, there's a breath I've been looking for that. So, uh, yeah. Well, pretty much a do nothing video, man. Just showing, just like I always do, man. Show what, uh, what the heck I'm doing that day. I just show what's going on and what we're doing. And, and today I I'm, I'm went from, uh, from burning to. I think I was doing over there, clearing, clearing stuff out over there too. I've been in listing. We're getting ready to go list a bunch more stuff. It's actually, the, I came in here and I went in and listed some stuff because the cut, cotton is popping. But right now, I can't I don't know if you can hear it, but the sky starting to rumble and it's supposed to. Uh, they're saying thunder showers, man. I hope it just dumps rain because it'll help with this cotton big time. That's all I got for you today, man. So please remember to like, subscribe, and share. Helps keep the lights on. Them home fires burning. And then propane tanks, fool. Still got to have propane for hot water, you know. Good Lord willing. And them creeks don't rise. Hey man, we're gonna pipe clean. We'll be back again tomorrow. See ya.